from an insane Joker half sleeve piece to a Superman logo watercolor piece that looks amazing, we take a look at 10 people with insane comic book tattoos. Number 10. Peanuts Arm Piece Charles M. Schultz created the Peanuts comic which aired from 1950 to 2000. Panels from the comics and Christmas specials are displayed here in this great Peanuts leg piece. The great zigzag line which outlines the bottom matches Charlie Brown's favorite shirt. It spawned animated TV specials and a lot of merchandise. Mr. Schultz requested that the printing of new comics be halted. Number 9. Joker Half Sleeve since Heath Ledger's rendition of the Joker in The Dark Knight, it has become one of the most famous villains in the movie industry. Here, a Joker is shown as a half-sleeve. In the Suicide Squad movie, which premieres in August, fans in Washington can also look forward to Jared Leto's rendition of the character. The Joker here, however, was taken from comic book illustrations. To give the character a more sinister and sick look, the artist used additional green outlines. The green hair is also used to border it nicely at the top and bottom. Number 8. Superhero Logos Watercolor In this peculiar piece, logos of numerous superheroes, including Marvel and DC, Thor, Deadpool, the X-Men, the Punisher, Iron Man, the Hulk, Batman, the Flash, and Green Lantern are present. The positioning is great and the watercolor effect blends well with the logos of the superheroes. Even though the picture is captioned Marvel, the blend of superheroes from all around the universe creates a beautiful style here. Number 7. Batman Starry Night The yellow and blue swirls of Van Gogh's Starry Night, combined with the Batman and Bat signal, creates a fascinating combination here. The shading and placement are great and beneath the Bat signal there is a view of the buildings in Gotham. Starry Night is one of the most popular images in the world. With blue swirls in the sky and star swirl orbs, it creates a dynamic mash of two famous art pieces. The town in Starry Night has been replaced here with buildings of Gotham, the home of Batman, by the tattooist. Number 6. Batman Comic Panel Sleeve a sleeve with a piece from the comic book is pictured here alongside the action word kapow and the signature box comic book panels at the bottom of the picture. Other action word bubbles like womp are seen at the top part of the piece. One of the most famous comic book series villains, the Penguin, and Batman's loyal sidekick are well drawn here. It also looks like the back of the Joker, one of the most prominent characters in the Batman world, is present at the left hand side with his purple jacket and bright green hair. Number 5. Harley Quinn and Catwoman Here we have Harley Quinn and Catwoman, two villains in the Batman comic books on matching arm pieces. They are placed with their legs spread out to look like a classic pinup pose, and this works well with the shape of their arm. They complement each other perfectly in the process while facing inward. Harley Quinn is to be featured in the new Suicide Squad movie which is to premiere in August. Number 4. Superman Logo Watercolor In this very unique tattoo, we have streaks of watercolor beneath the great Superman logo. It has the look of a cape which adds a nice perspective to the piece. It also has a watercolor square beneath which resembles a cape. Placing it further down the Hope tattoo would have been fair so as to prevent them from overlapping. The shading and lines make it look like it is a part of the painting and gives it a more realistic look. Number 3. Calvin and Hobbes Feet both of the subject's feet are completely filled with a Calvin and Hobbes piece, one foot containing Hobbes and the other with Calvin on it. The grass and water areas are shaded properly around the edges in a fuzz-like manner to make it almost look as if it had been painted on. The trees in the painting are also shaded properly, and the multiple shades of brown give it a wonderful dimension. The highlights in the waterfall make it look as if the water is actually dripping from the creek. The shading and detail given to the area around the grass and near the water also have an impressive view. Number 2. Snoopy Arm Piece A great Snoopy tattoo with in-progress pics is featured here on the list. The piece looks nice and is brought together with the shades done around Snoopy. The fuzz around the edge gives the piece a nice comic book feel and the in-progress pictures are great to look at. It shows the piece coming together over the multiple sessions and the tiny lines around it add motion to it. Additional effects, like the stream of smoke emerging from behind the dog, add even more touch to the picture. Number 1. 
Spider-Man and Venom Full Back Piece. Number one on this list is a very elaborate and well-executed comic book panel of various fighting scenes. This full back piece is dedicated to Spider-Man fighting with Venom, his enemy. The shades are extremely good and the positioning is accurate. There are also some Spider-Man and Venom pictures around the edges of the piece. If you look closer, you'll notice that Iron Man makes a small appearance in the top right corner. The outlines are great from the top down to the bottom center panel.